Hello, welcome to Techie Tutor. Today I'm going to go over a few new tips that I'd like to share with you. I'm going to be showing you some hidden features of iOS 17, so stay tuned and let's get started. I'm going to open up my messages and I'm going to create a new message. I'm going to just put a funny sentence in here. I want pizza on an airplane and then I want to play basketball. Now look what happens. When I press the emoji symbol, some of the words turn orange. And I was always wondering why they turn orange, but did you know if you tap on the orange words, an emoji pops up and then you can easily change it. So tap on basketball, tap on pizza, there we go, we have our airplane, and now we have a very exciting message to send with three emojis right in there. But I thought that was a pretty cool hidden feature. So next time you're writing a message when you notice some words are in orange, what that means is that there's a paired emoji that goes with that word. And here's another really cool feature that you can use when you're typing, no matter where you're typing, whether it's in an email or on messages, you can easily place your cursor just by using the trackpad function. Here you go, let me show you. When you're having trouble moving that cursor, try this. Hold down the space bar and you'll notice that all the letters disappear and they become a trackpad. You can easily move the cursor anywhere. And this is easier for me. Let's say I wanna change the word I to we. It was just that easy. And here's another quick tip. If you are typing, whether it's in iMessage or Notes or in any app, and you would like to access additional characters, when you're typing, if you hold down the character, other possibilities will appear. So if you need, for some reason, another uh, character, it will come through. So again, what you will do is while you're typing, you hold down any character and the other options come through just by an extended hold. If you found this video helpful, please press the like button and subscribe so you'll be notified of any new videos I have. And let me know in the comments if you found it helpful or what videos you'd like to see next.